Hey, I'm Jeremy Metcalf with the Benville Fire Department. We're here doing a final inspection on our new rescue truck that we just purchased. It's a custom Typhoon uh, dry rescue, no pump or tank on it. Uh, the city of Benville, we're just shy of 34 square miles. Uh, we currently have six stations. Our seventh station will be open here in just another month or two. Uh, we have 84 line firefighters um, looking to, uh, we've got a few more spots to fill this year and we've got 14 spots that we're going to be hiring for next year we hope. The rescue truck that we built this time is designed basically we're going to go switch to the electric or battery operated uh, power tools. Um, this will be our first time with that. We've ran the hydraulic like everybody else has forever and um, so we designed this truck to kind of meet the needs of that and so we've got a lot more uh, 110 type plug-ins in this truck so that we can keep everything charged up, batteries, uh, hazmat monitors, EMS equipment, stuff like that. Um, other than that, the truck's got a tremendous amount of storage on it. We added storage on the top of the truck. Uh, we've got a dry hopper with uh, that'll hold 200 pounds of floor dry. Um, so a lot of firsts that we haven't done before with this truck. So. And it turned out really well. Our dealership is uh, Sunbelt in Fairhope, Alabama. And Clint is our sales rep, lives in Conway, which is just an hour and a half from us. Uh, Clint's always been really good to work with. Um, every time we've come down here, we've always been treated really well. Uh, doing our final today, we just had a few little minor issues, and uh, before we even left, they were already pulling the truck around to take care of them. So um, nothing major. The truck down turned out good, and uh, everybody's been pleasant to work with. We've been here three or four times. You know the guys that are here today, and anytime you walk in, it's still like a kid with all the trucks lined up in there. We're looking in compartments, going, "Man, we should add this. We should do this." So it's always fun to come down here and, and see the you know what other departments are doing with their trucks, and we you know we tend to take things that we like off this truck and next truck we build. We've got an engine in the works right now, so we're already thinking, okay, there's things we want to add to this engine, so um, it's supposed to be done sometime mid next year or so.